Good morning. Good morning to all of you here and to our uh, home audience as well. And Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Okay, that was a day or two ago. However, this is the first Sunday in the year 2020. And I notice, as you probably all have noticed, that the human vibrations around the beginning of the new year are always quite high. And in truth, January 1 or January 5, which is today, is like every other day. It has 24 hours. Human interactions encounter the same range of experiences from outpouring of love and harmony to possible conflict and sometimes resolution. What makes the new year seem different is the collective consciousness or belief that life becomes anew in a new year. Whatever may have seemed to have been lacking in the previous year is now a real possible possibility for the believer. January 1 is typically launched with positive intention and expectancy. If you have an intention for 2020, bring it to your mind now. And if there's something from last year that you want to be different this year, imagine right now, just imagine how you might feel if that change occurred. So now, take in a deep, slow breath and close your eyes if you wish. Notice your body in this space. Notice how the breath moves in through your nose and out again. And consciously take 10 slow nurturing breaths now. As you continue to breathe, notice that you can direct your attention anywhere you'd like to go. I invite you to draw your attention to the center of your head, imagining that you're going deep into the center of your consciousness, about eye level. Any time your mind water, wanders, bring your awareness back to this spot at the center of your head. Within you is a knowing that God, spirit, or whatever you name it, is infinite in its power where all things are possible. <laughs> Like a drop of water in the ocean, you are one with spirit, one with the presence and the energy of creation. With ease, let anything come to mind from last year that you would like to release, any incident, any resentment, any held on anger, any jealousy, or any other ill feeling. (coughs) 
You are making space in your consciousness for what you do want. Imagine these feelings as a ball of energy. I invite you to release that ball of energy. Perhaps it floats off into the sun to be burned up in its rays. Maybe you imagine an angel coming down and carrying it safely away. Or maybe it just disappears. As you watch this energy leave, how do you feel? Take a few minutes to enjoy this feeling of release. Now let us fill in those spots that housed old energy. Recall earlier in this process how you thought you would feel if your desired change in the new year manifested. Perhaps you would feel joyful, rich, loved and loving, fulfilled, or grateful. Fill in the blank with your expected feeling. How would you feel? <laughs> As we now move into silence, continue conscious breathing and allow these feelings to expand. And on each exhale, silently say, thank you.
Gently allow your awareness to return to the room. Return to the room gradually with all your senses. Notice the sounds, the temperature, the light, the textures, and people around you. And you may open your eyes when you're ready. May you nurture your relationship with spirit and create quiet moments to connect with divine guidance. May you grow spiritually with an attitude of gratitude. And so it is. Today's inspirational message is presented by Reverend Eileen Brownell. And I don't believe I introduced myself today. I'm Sandy Golke, a licensed emeritus practitioner, and I'm glad you're all here. <laughs>